Good morning, girl with MS here. Oh, wow. I have to thank you guys for your encouragement because I would probably still be in bed right now. Uh, I had a wonderful trip to Texas to see family and friends and um, got a lot of great exercise and almost felt like I reached a whole new level with living with MS and um, but boy did I wake up sore today I just ooh, you know and um, part of me wanted to stay in bed and uh, <laughs> you know I don't know right and but I'd already been doing that for th three hours it's I've been up for for hours I had a wonderful night's sleep and whatever but I am uh, I had a great time but I know with my MS I've got to learn you know I'm always thinking of that balance I'm don't have very oh well kind of doing it but as much as I know I wanted to stay in bed today, I knew I needed to start moving. And I don't know about you all, but I am, I'm just stiff. So we're gonna kind of get into a gentle flow here. I don't know, just as I do, do what feels good. Remember to do both sides or stay balanced as well as you can. Right now I'm just focusing on breathing. Breathing deeply and breathing into the muscles and body and tendon that's sore. Um, I like to focus my energy on those areas. But also being aware, you know, I, like right there, I have such a tendency to raise my shoulders and why waste the energy? You know, we want to be relaxed. We want our chest up so we can get the most you know, out of our breathing and So, although I've been awake for a few hours, I don't feel very awake. Definitely not physically awake. Just very gentle stretch here. Sometimes I like to reach out like I'm opening a doorknob just to, I don't know, you can, I can feel the energy kind of shooting through different little parts of my body. I caught myself there. I was really starting to just <laughs> slouch. Can't do that. That's not the point, you know. It's uh, keeping your knees relaxed, but our posture up toward the heavens and the skies. Hmm. Oh God, down into the earth, you know, just feeling that energy. And I'm just going to slowly, very slowly and gently start to stretch a little bit more and bend over. It's a Saturday, but it's a compassionate Saturday. It's, I'm feeling stiff. <laughs> I don't know about you all, but 
this feels really good. And uh, I guess what I love about stretching is it's not a competition, you know, no expectations. Just stretch into what's stiff and what's sore and open it up. Sometimes I like to you know, kind of open up my hips when I'm stretching down and I'll kind of put my toes in a little bit. You can feel, you know, feel different things opening and stretching and maybe do the opposite and put your toes out a little. Sorry, toes out, you know, and you can feel a different sort of stretch. I just like to feel around until everything starts to feel a little bit you know, lubricated and moving. Gosh, I, I keep tensing up. I tense up in the shoulders. I tense up in the knees. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, my balance is a little off. I didn't do any yoga while I was gone or any stretching. I can't call this yoga, but this is just this is just my exercises, but ooh. <laughs> I can feel how crooked I am. I think maybe part of why I've been sore is that I've been wearing some old uh, old walking shoes. I've been walking more, but they're about, I bet they're about three or four, four years old, and uh, they feel good, but uh, I know, I don't think that's good to, to wear old shoes. Whoa. Okay. Um, baby steps, right? A little off balance on this side. I don't know what's got my balance off. I think just I'm not practicing, right? We've got to practice. Use it or lose it. Hmm. Got to do this, way, but I can just, I feel myself twisted and crooked. So important to just breathe and open up and straighten. Be aware of your body, you know. That, to me, with MS is the most important thing, is to be aware and to listen. And um, to listen. <laughs> listen to your body and to react accordingly. Do what it's asking for. I mean, my body was begging me to come out and just, you know, whatever it was, just get moving, get, I, I don't know the words, the, the, but get the muscles going and get the energy flowing and, you know, oh. Okay, <laughs> so I'm just gonna kind of, obviously break into a little bit more movement here. I don't know, where do you guys get stiff the most? Like, when you go to stretch. I'm really feeling it today. I'm feeling it right here. Like, here. Here. This feels really tight. That's not a normal spot for me, so I think I'm probably, maybe woke up some new muscles, you know, or old muscles. These last couple of days, getting a lot more exercise out there. Wow. Oh, 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 that feels good. Yeah, I don't really know what I'm doing here, but. but yeah, right, right in here. I'm totally do it. Like I said, I just do what feels good. If it hurts, I don't do it. But wow. Okay. 
You know what it is? It's that muscle that goes from your right ear to your left toe. And I know that because I experienced the same soreness the first time I ever went snowboarding. And I was in shape back then. I mean, I was strong. Man, I woke up the next day and I felt like I'd been hit by a train. That's what I felt like today. Huh. Look in there. Ooh. <laughs> I know this is a weird stretch, but it's just this whole part of the body just Sometimes my body just seizes, does yours, you know, kind of, if I stay in a position and I'm not warmed up, it'll just seize up. I think it feels good if it's really sore is just, you know, rub the muscle. This might be a good morning because it's cool out um, to maybe take a warm bath or, um, you know, warm up those muscles even more. But this is, this is working for me. I, I don't know about you guys, but gosh, well, I feel a lot better than I did five minutes ago. Okay. Thank you. And thank you. This was a very random free flow session, you guys. I just, I had to get out and get moving. If I didn't take opportunity, I would not have done this. I'm going to do some more, but I'm going to cut this off and I'll just record a bit, maybe later or whatever. Uh, but I'm really glad I came out here. I just, I feel so much better. I needed that. I needed this motivation to come outside stay inside where it's nice and warm and get the body moving and now i'm ready to take it to the next step so i'll talk to you guys later have a good one